Welcome to another Preventure Adventure. And tonight finds me um, at the recommendation of... Oh my gosh. I hope I get this right because there's a first name and a last name. Connor Kent. I don't think it's Kent Connor. I think it's Connor Kent. And I'm in Old Saybrook, Connecticut at a uh, restaurant known as Luigi's. It's a very warm Saturday in May, so the place is filling up fast, but not a problem, because I just order takeout anyhow. So I went all out here. Uh, I'm gonna have more food than I can ever eat, but that's okay. Got some garlic bread, my meatballs, and something I have never tried before. This is called Chicken Leonardo. It's chicken and pasta, spinach, peppers, Sounded pretty good on the menu, and that's where I'm at. So let me uh, turn this camera around, and we'll get started. All right, let's get started. I forgot my bib tonight. Turned around and went back, knowing I was going Italian. So my shirt is protected. This is supposed to be, according to their website, famous garlic bread, better than any other you've ever tried. Pretty good. Plenty going on here. I like it. Meatballs are very solid, which may or may not be a good thing. I don't know. Let's see. Chewy. Plenty of sauce with them. Just the sauce. I mean, Fat matter of fact, be dipping some bread into this sauce. It's a pretty good sauce. Meatballs, well. Very solid, very, very heavy. Uh, quite chewy. Alright. Came with a salad. I don't know. Might, might not eat that after. All right, let's start with a piece of the chicken. Maybe slightly undercooked. There's some hot peppers in here and it's, uh, I believe the chicken is sauteed in that sauce. So you, there's a little, a nice little bite to that chicken. There goes my first piece of pasta. So I, if you've been watching me, you know I'm usually a uh, chicken parm guy, which they have on the menu. But I went somewhere and um, did not prepare myself for this video very well. But a guy sent me out to Manchester to try some pasta carbonara. And I looked for that, and that was on the menu. I thought, maybe I should go that way. But then I saw this, and I said, that sounds interesting, too. Broaden my horizons just a little. Not too much. Don't get too excited here, but just a little. Okay, let me eat the food. I'll come back and tell you what my final thoughts are. Okay, final thoughts from... Oh, sorry. 
It's going to be getting darker here. Maybe we should put the light on. From Luigi's in uh, Old Saybrook, Connecticut. First off, thank you to Connor Kent. I, I really enjoyed that. Uh, the garlic bread was very good. Very enjoyable. I don't know what they did different, but I really liked it. They really saturated the bread and uh, just was good all the way through. The meatballs, I liked the marinara quite a bit. Um, not a fan of the meatballs themselves, just quite chewy, rubbery. Not cooked in the sauce, but cooked separately and then put in the sauce. And that just kind of impacted the uh, the flavor of them. Not the flavor. The flavor was great. The texture. Sorry, I'm watching someone try to park. I guess I can't do two things at once anymore. So, nice flavor. Very solid. A lot of meat. Just pretty chewy. The pasta. I really like that pasta. The flavor was great. I've always been a red sauce with pasta guy. I, uh, thanks to recommendations here, I've kind of expanded the way I think a little bit, just a little, and uh, I just really enjoyed that pasta. The, there's a nice bite to it with the hot peppers. It, it was chicken was sautéed in that, and then it was put in with all that other stuff, so it impacted the pasta also. Just a really, really nice flavor. That that I enjoyed that very much. I really liked the pasta. <laughs> salad is salad. I'll be taking that home. I didn't eat it. I don't know if I showed it to you. Here's their salad. Isn't that beautiful? Uh, the bib was definitely a one-time use because that baby got pounded. So back into the wash cycle for that one. So what am I thinking here as I babble on? My meal also came with a bit of bread, and it was, uh, I've had two or three pieces of it, but, but here's here's what it looked like, and this was nice and fresh, and that dipped nicely into the, into the marinara sauce with the meatballs. So overall, not a fan of the meatballs, but everything else I really enjoyed, and, and just the meatballs, the meatball sauce, very nicely done. So... Zero to ten. What am I thinking here? I didn't give this any thought beforehand, which is probably a good thing. <laughs> Would I come back? Yeah. Did I like it? Yeah. Um, zero to ten. Luigi's in Old Saybrook, Connecticut. Those meatballs are going to drag it down a little bit. We know I like my meatballs. Someone said, I'm a meatball expert, and I said, no, the only thing I'm an expert at is getting stains on shirts and taking stains off shirts. So, overall, still still an 8.1. I, I liked it that much. The, the meatballs dragged that down a bit, but still an 8.1. Enjoyable meal. I would come back. Just wouldn't do the meatballs. I'd try something different. They have plenty of stuff. It's a pretty nut large... Uh, menu on this thing. So, Luigi's, Old Saybrook, Connecticut, 8.1.